Hey there, Louis Akabalas here. Thanks for stopping by. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can create a classic site in SharePoint Online. Now, before we get started, if you find this video helpful, please hit that thumbs up below and be sure to subscribe if you haven't already to stay up to date on the latest tutorials that I publish. Now let's go ahead and let's get started. All right, in order to create a classic site in SharePoint Online, you will need access to the SharePoint Admin Center. Once you've navigated to the Admin Center, you want to click on the Active Sites option in the Navigation menu. Next, you want to click on Create a Site. And on this panel, you want to scroll to the bottom and you want to click on Other Options. Next, you want to click into the Choose a Template field and you want to scroll down and click on More Templates. Now you are going to get this pop-up box here that says reload site. You can just go ahead and click reload or cancel. And you will notice that your browser is also going to open a new tab and it's going to bring you into this create a site collection page. And you'll notice here that this page resembles the classic experience. Next, you want to give your site a title and then you want to populate the URL for your site. So you can see here I've entered classic SP, which is going to form the basis of my URL. Now you'll notice in the template selection field, you can see this text here that reads 2013 experience version will be used. So that is to signal that this is going to be a classic SharePoint site that we're setting up. Next, you want to select a template that best matches the purpose of your site. Now these templates are out of the box site templates. And again, these templates are going to be the classic SharePoint templates. So you can see here under collaboration, you have access to team site, developer site, project site, community site, and you can click into these other tabs to see which other site templates are available. Next, you want to set your time zone for your site and you want to add your site collection administrator. Now to do that, you wanna go ahead and click on the address book icon. And here you can search through your SharePoint environment to find users that you would like to designate as the SharePoint site collection administrator. Now I've just typed my name in the find field and I'm gonna select myself and click okay. And that's going to populate me in the administrator field. Next, you want to click on okay. Now you can see that it brought me back to the active sites page of the SharePoint admin center. Now, in order to find that classic site collection that you created, you want to click on the All Sites dropdown and you want to set this filter to Classic Sites. And you can see here the site that we just created with the URL Classic SP. If I go ahead and click on this, it's going to open a new browser tab and you can see here that we created this classic site in SharePoint Online. So that's it. In this tutorial, I showed you how you can create a classic site in SharePoint Online from the SharePoint Online Admin Center. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you did, please hit that thumbs up below and be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on the latest tutorials that I publish. I'm Louis Yacobalas. Thanks for stopping by. Talk soon.